guess so, like more of the point is, should we, I guess in a sense what I'm saying is like let go of certain traits, like everybody, if everybody was the same race, like let's say like, like, what, like whatever country, we all came from the same country, we're all the same like culture and ethnicity, then we would still have, like, like, like it's, 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 sorry, sure, it's, no, I, no. but like, yeah, so like we're all, everybody still has their own problems, like regardless of if you are the same culture, yeah. race or anything, so like, I don't know, I, I think it's just, homogeneity I think is good or bad, and I just don't know if it's like good enough to kind of like let go of our ethnicity and our culture. Yeah, no, I, I totally hear what you're saying. I think, <clears throat> I think that um, we go through stages of development. So one of the stages of development that we go through in terms of our country is like ethnocentricity. And I still think that in the world we tend to be hugely ethnocentric. But one of the, and that essentially defines your primary values. But I think one of the things that as a culture and as humanity that we need to evolve to is a shift in our primal relationship to what it means to exist. So I think that is a global centricity, you know what I'm saying, like a human-centric relationship to life that we haven't actually shifted into as a planet. I think once we, which doesn't deny our cultural differences, which doesn't deny our heritage, but our fundamental reference point is to the fact that we're all human beings first, as opposed to our country first. And I think that's a shift that is going to happen as we evolve, and I think that's the shift that, that you're speaking. 